the show tonight, we've got the Incredible Hulk. I'm really looking forward to meeting him. I just hope nothing's going to annoy me. You know, because if I want... Oh, no, please, stop taking pictures! Stop it! I'm getting annoyed now. I'm getting a little angry. I'm getting very, very angry! Well, let's start the show! Myself, I'm calm, but I'm not really calm because I'm very excited. We've got a blockbusting lineup for you tonight. He is the Incredible Hulk in the new Marvel Avengers film. Mark Ruffalo is here. <laughs> yeah. The hottest rapper on the planet, Nicki Minaj, is on the show. <laughs> Comedian and comic relief superhero John Bishop is here. <laughs> Wonderful Rufus Wainwright, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, oh it's so good. I, I'm looking forward to asking Mark all about his new superhero uh, movie, Avengers Assemble. Yes. Uh, Mark stars as the Incredible Hulk. Uh, when he gets upset, he doubles in size and then shrinks again. You know, sort of like Oprah Winfrey, but green. <laughs> People uh, say the Hulk was created in a lab. I say no. I say he's the love child of these two. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Pregnant, I have made you. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just the Hulk. There are lots of other superheroes too, like uh, Thor. There he is. I am Thor. Oh, where are you, Thor? Did you hit a thumb with the hammer? <laughs> then there's Captain America. Yes. Oh, I tell you, not only a superhero, but according to that star on his chest, employee of the month at McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm really thrilled that one of the world's biggest music stars, Nicki Minaj, is here. <laughs> and uh, people at home, people at home, before you ring in to complain, that isn't real leopard skin. All right. <laughs> Although, in fairness, it is a real badger on her head. <laughs> it's alive, just hanging on for your life. <laughs> Nikki's such a trendsetter, she really is. <laughs> and uh, so very generous. You know, when she finished with that hairstyle, she donated it to some children. She did. <laughs> so, Nicki Minaj and the Hulk together at last. So, strangest show this couple since Simon Cowell and Danny Minogue. <laughs> I know! I know! It's rumored that Simon Cowell and Danny had an affair. Oh, apparently it was very passionate. Yeah, they laughed together. They cried together. <laughs> Mainly they were vaguely surprised together. <laughs> uh, Cowell also said that he lusted after Cheryl Cole. Mm. And I think we've got a photo of the exact moment that he propositioned her. Welcome to everyone on my couch. Thank you. In fairness, one person on the couch has made more of an effort than the others. That's all I'm saying. Uh, you look lovely, Nicki Minaj. Thank you. Do, you, do you go shopping? Do you go into a shop and buy what you're wearing? No. <laughs> and summers. <laughs> I, don't go, I don't go shopping. 
shopping. You don't never go shopping? No, they bring me like stuff for me to choose from a lot of times. It's easier like that. And you, and, and you look very stylish as well. Well, thank you. <laughs> don't, 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 don't even think about it. I know. <laughs> I made an effort. <laughs> I, I, I put on a flowery shirt. I'm now confident in my sexuality that I can put on a flowery shirt. I, I thought I'm making effort because I'm next to a style icon. And we were stood back there and Nikki said to me, you look wonderful. <laughs> she never. She never. <laughs> she, went, she went, sorry, who are you? <laughs> Now, uh, Mark, very, very exciting, because uh, Avengers Assembled... That's right. Which, now, it's called Avengers Assembled here because we had the you Avengers. Had the original Avengers. But this has nothing to do with the Avengers. No. No. This is a whole other Avengers. This is all the Marvel superheroes brought Put together. Put together. The, the mother of comic book movies. And it is amazing. Like, they're all in it. It's you it, as the Incredible Hulk. It's Iron Man, Captain America, Thor, the Black Widow. It's phenomenal. Because you're the first Incredible Hulk who's motion capture, aren't you? That's right. I'm the first actor to play both Banner and the Hulk. What? Well, very good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, listen, we've got a, a clip, and it's, it's towards the beginning of the movie when you are Dr. Banner, and it's them, they've come to find you. That's but right. they know what happens when you get angry. Yeah, they don't want to make me angry. Nobody wants to make you angry. <laughs> so it's uh, you and Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> and <laughs> and I, I don't mean, I mean, I mean this as a compliment, but you seem like unusual casting for this, because you are, it seems to me in the, in the movies I've seen, you always play quite laid back people, you seem like quite a laid back man. Is that why they cast you? I think they wanted it to be um, as far from angry as they could possibly get without the person actually being asleep. <laughs> <laughs> and I fit the bill. Because it's a weird superpower anger. Like when you think about the times you actually get angry, like internet banking Not or great something. Things, you know, it's just, it's, <laughs> tweets, yeah. uh, emails. The, when you send that that stuff off, it usually doesn't go over very well. No, I, I mean, do you get angry? Are you kidding me? I have a saying: if you're not yelling at your kids, you're not spending enough time with them. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, John, are you are you again seem really laid back? Are you quick to anger? Um. I don't think I am, but then, then occasions happen, don't they? Like, we, we, we went skiing recently, which is an odd thing to do <laughs> if you're from Liverpool, because uh, <laughs> there wasn't a lot of skiing lessons in our class. You know? <laughs> Not many people went skiing, and, and I, we, we went to the Alps skiing, and, and like, over here, it's quite a middle-class thing to do, and I come down the hill skiing which is not a great sight to see, to be honest. And I came down, <laughs> and my oldest son was at the bottom of the hill, and he'd obviously, there'd been something that had happened between him and another man who was skiing. And the other man was getting out of his skis as if to punch my son. So I come down the hill, stop on my skis, and then start threatening the man and trying to run after him with his skis. <laughs> Have you ever tried to look hard when you've got the feet of a clown on one? <laughs> so there's a point where you can be angry and get away with it, and there's a point where you just look like a dog. <laughs> and uh, Nicki Minaj, you, are, you, are, you, are you angry very often? No. <laughs> no I'm, I'm hesitate to ask, I don't want you to turn green or anything. Okay. But did Twitter make you angry recently? <laughs> No! A voice, a voice in my head told me to delete my Twitter, and that's what I did. Okay. And, and are you back on yet? No. No? And how many followers did you have? 11 million. <laughs> <laughs> that's a country! I... <laughs> you, you could have been a dictator! <laughs> Thank you! Well, you do something like, who are they following now? <laughs> oh, I hope they'll wait for me. Um... I know, I know they will. Can I ask, did you ever reply to anyone? Yeah! <laughs> I reply to people all the time. I'm known for that. That's no, I, I don't mean like just now. I mean, like, like 
<laughs> on Twitter yes. because if you've got 11 million, it's impossible. No, surely. I do, and I and I get to know them by name, and I I get a really personal bond with them. Yeah. Not all 11 million, <laughs> but you know, here and there, I try. I responded to at least 10 people a day. I would say. Okay, that's not that many, is it? Uh, <laughs> it's quite a lot of time <laughs> for Nikki. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting that easily, okay? <laughs> now, very exciting because when you're in a big movie like Avengers Assembled, uh, of course, it comes with that is the toys. And uh, this, actually, your toy is pretty good. Have you seen it yet? Yeah. Because, no, what's clever, because it's motion capture, it is sort of your face. It's... It... <laughs> <laughs> well, no, okay. Do, do, do we have a still from the movie? That's see, me. So that is kind of your face in a weird, not very flattering way. <laughs> okay, I take it back. Thank you. Um, <laughs> and you can play with it. it... Yeah, and you can tickle you. <laughs> and then you can do that. <laughs> sort of run out now, but... Uh... <laughs> ooh, ooh. All right, sorry. He goes off. He won't stop yeah. now. He really won't stop. No, it goes for a half yeah. an hour. Um, he's still growling down there. He is. Okay. <laughs> now, obviously, you know, it's great. Here you are in a big, you know, the movie. This is going to be the movie of the year, isn't it? Yeah. Some people are saying that, yeah. yeah. It's, it's tracking to be the biggest movie ever made. It kind of, it, he's not making that up. It really is. Yeah. I, I didn't have anything to do with that. Yeah. Well, you do because the Hulk steals the movie. Thank it, you. you are, you've got the funniest bits, the best bits. It's, yeah, it's great. Thank you. Um, but what's amazing, and it should give everyone hope, is that it took like you were not an overnight sensation like it did take you a lot like people would have given up like what i'm saying i'm i'm like a 30 year overnight sensation <laughs> how many auditions do you think you did before you got a job well it's sort of been mythologized now but it started with about 600. wow most people smart people quit <laughs> When it takes that long. What was giving you hope? I, I couldn't do anything else. Uh, <laughs> but you've done a lot of theater, haven't you, over the years? That's right. Yeah. And sometimes uh, incredibly convincing performances. Didn't you, like, cross sometimes a Sometimes more than others. Yeah, didn't you, like, cross a line? In a <clears throat> was it your fault that you crossed the line? Or is it somebody set you up? Oh, you're talking about that. Uh, yes. Um, <laughs> There was a play that I did that I had to, um, I, I, I smoked a joint in the first scene. And, um, of course, there was a very, um, a very naughty young actor I was in the play with who, uh, on the opening night with all the critics... Oh, the opening night? He, uh, slipped a real joint... <gasps> ...onto the prop table. <laughs> and I'm out there, and, and I'm just... Now, when you're acting, you overdo everything. So, when you're out at a party, you take two puffs and you say, okay, that's enough, I'm so stoned. <laughs> but I was acting. And so I'm just like... <laughs> I'll save you. <laughs> I literally, we, between the two of us, we smoked a giant blunt on stage. And I'm, I'm like, man, I am in it tonight. I feel it. I'm on fire, man. I'm feeling it. And, 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 and I... Why is that dude standing backstage laughing at me? <laughs> and the kid who put the joint on the prop table, standing there going... <laughs> and I just went... Oh, shit. <laughs> and um, the girl that I was passing it to had never smoked pot in her oh, life. Oh, my God! I, had, up to that point, had smoked a lot of pot. <laughs> So I was I know you haven't, and I know you have. No, Barb's don't ever do drugs, okay? <laughs> Love you too. We interrupt this anecdote for a message.
Back to your regularly scheduled program. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. We returned. It was the Buffalo. worst thing I ever did. Don't do it. <laughs> but at the end of the play, um, I got the best reviews of my entire career. <laughs>